Hey guys, welcome to the video. So I know I haven't really uploaded recently, but I haven't really been able to sleep. I've been up all night at like 5 a.m. Then I've been sleeping all the way to like 5 p.m. So yeah, I've been sleeping my days away and I haven't really been able to record at night because I don't want to wake anyone else up. So today we're going to be talking about some operator ideas. Um, These are like five different operator ideas that I thought of. One probably came from somebody else, a friend of mine, or like a video I saw once. I try not to watch any more videos just so they don't like influence my ideas. All right, so now let's get into it. The first one is an operator who can shield defensive gadgets. Now, this would be a defensive operator. I would say like a one speed three armor and pretty much they have like a metal dome shape bubble that they can place over teammates gadgets. Um, I would say three of them. I want to say four, but I feel four is too much and there would be a, like a circle cut out from the top so you can put it on top of Jaeger's ADS and it still be effective because it doesn't make sense if it's like all closed off at the top, but pretty much it makes the gadget unaffected by twitch and Thatcher's EMPs but to make it fair I would say it should it should take three shock charges from twitch so two to get rid of the dome and the last one to actually destroy the equipment and then two of Thatcher's EMPs to actually destroy it uh, of course it could be like shot or meleeed if it's meleeed I think it should be meleeed twice to destroy the dome and the gadget under it so just because you destroyed the dome doesn't mean you actually destroy the gadget you have to destroy the gadget after the dome um I think this will be very useful for the defensive team so this gadget will like protect whatever you want to protect you only get three so you cannot protect all of bandits batteries or all of mutes uh, signal disruptors I don't feel like it would be too overpowered I'm not really sure how it exactly would work but I feel like it's a good gadget all right the next operator is someone who cannot be seen on cameras pretty much this is an attacking operator most likely a three-speed one armor operator they have like a camera scrambler like on their body so whenever they go by a camera they cannot be detected by it they cannot be seen on the camera nor could they be detected by the camera when you like press triangle or why I forget what it's called I would make it similar to Kavira silent step so it have to it would have to refresh after you know like 15 20 seconds or something so this would be useful um you know if you can't locate a Valkyrie camera and you're tired of being spotted and say you don't want to like shoot the camera and like give away her position so you can just turn it on and like move from room to room or move across the hallway to another room or another location so I think it would come in handy I um, don't know really how other people would use utilize it I don't know yeah so that's it for that one so the third one is another attacking operator pretty much this operator is someone who can hack defensive equipment now I would personally give this one to IQ because I feel her gadget should be this um so pretty much it would just be IQ and she would be able to still you know detect gadgets but instead of having to shoot it with the pistol she would be able to do something on her arm and hack it so if it's a camera she could hack the camera and the attacking team could use that camera and so if there is like an ADS or a bandit's battery she could hack it and destroy it I would say only up to about three items she's able to destroy or hack but the plus side is for the defensive team is that mute uh, would pretty much cancel it out so if there is a gadget near a mute signal disruptor could not be seen by this gadget so you would have to get rid of the signal disruptor to be able to see everything that's near it all right next up would be a heat sensor operator with a heat sensor this is kind of weird I think this is probably my favorite one that I've thought of so pretty much this is an attacking operator I would say probably like a two speed two armor or a one speed three armor operator they put a device on the wall like reinforced walls or barricades things of that nature and it detects heat signatures so it's similar to pulses heartbeat monitor except it's like a heat signature and makeup of the body for the attacking team um, you can also put it on unbreakable surfaces as long as it's a floor like you cannot put it on an unbreakable wall or like the roof of a building unless the roof has a hatch then you could put it on the hatch of course it would have to balance it so it's not like you can see the entire room uh, it would only be like a certain distance you can see or say if there's like more than one wall behind it you cannot see past the other two walls so it would be like the immediate room or the immediate surface and I would make it so this operator could kind of see it similar to Jackal where they would have goggles and they can see the Higgs heat signatures but the teammates can access like the drone cameras and cycle through to the heat sensor and be able to look at it that way. Now the only counters are mute signal disruptors and bandits batteries and the other thing I would say is you only get two of them you wouldn't get like three or four I believe that's too excessive two would be like the perfect 
you know, amount, kind of like Mira's, uh, Mira, like Mira's mirror. <laughs> and you cannot pick it up also, just like her mirror. You cannot take it off the wall. When it's placed there, it stays there unless it's destroyed. Okay, the last one is actually a defensive operators. I know the last three were all attacking, but this one's a defensive operators. I'm not really sure how I feel about this one, um, but pretty much it's an operator who can amplify sound and they would be a two speed two armor operator and their gadget would either be two or three devices like mini microphones that can amplify footsteps in a room. They would also be able to amplify like gunshots and operator callouts on the attacking team. So like when they um, throw their drones, they're like drone ready or something like that. And you can hear it louder in that direction. So if you know like where you put it at and like your teammates know where you put it at, then they would be able to identify the sound. I'm just not sure if it should just be that operator or the whole defensive team should be able to hear it louder in that area or if everyone on the map should be able to hear it loud on that area but I feel it should only affect the attacking team so if the defensive team goes in that room their footsteps are not louder to the attacking team and these little microphones will work similar to about cameras so you can stick it on walls stick it on ceilings if you want to throw it outside for some reason you can throw it outside and I would think it would amplify like a certain you know a certain radius like 10 meters 15 meters something like that nature either that either like a certain radius it would amplify but it have it would have to be a big radius for it to be like actually useful it can't just be like two yards or something two yards across it would have to be an entire room or something like that or like half a room an entire room or entire hallway you know something substantial so it's not so it's actually useful shooting at twitch or thatcher would probably just be the only counters to this now i feel the attacking team should be able to know that it there is a microphone in the room so kind of like how the cameras light up when you see it batteries make a sound uh jaeger's ads make a sound mute signal disruptor makes a sound i feel this should make a you know Know, like a buzzing sound like a microphone's buzzing sound if you ever like had a microphone that's wasn't really plugged in all the way it makes a sound something like that so it should be able to make some kind of sound so the attacking team could you know pick up on it and know that okay there is a microphone in this room but it shouldn't be like easy to find okay guys so that is all my ideas i hope you enjoyed the video if you did please leave a like and comment down below which one was your favorite ideas and do you have any other ideas or how would you change any of my ideas that's a lot of things to comment down below fuck um <laughs> <laughs> well just comment down um which idea do you like the best or if you have a better idea that you would you know like me to know about um so thank you guys so much for watching uh please subscribe if you want more videos i'll probably doing i'm not gonna say that i think that's it uh <laughs> like i said comment i think i said subscribe for more videos if i didn't subscribe for more videos and that's all bye